guys, it's Regina from RemarReview.com. This video is going to be the five most common errors that new nurses make, in my humble opinion. Here they are. Mistake number one, new nurses are sometimes in a rush. Well, most of the time, they're rushing around because their time management skills aren't built up all the way. And I see them very, very frequently putting blood pressure cuffs over patients who have antecubital IV sites. Integrity is going to be compromised. So the IV site will start bleeding, it will be shifted, your patient will need a new IV. When you come in, always make sure that you know exactly where your patient's IV is established so that you can avoid messing with it during your shifts. For new nurses, applying a new IV site takes a long time and you already have many many things to do. The second common error that I see new nurses make is not knowing who their patient's primary physician is. They may have a surgery consult, there is the intern, there's the attending. So if your patient has any complications you don't try to have to figure out in an emergency situation who should you be calling. At the beginning of your shift make sure you write down who the primary physician is. The third most common mistake that new nurses make is they do not properly introduce themselves. And I'm not just talking about, hi, my name is Regina and I'm your nurse today. You need to include other details about yourself and about what's gonna happen today to make your life easier. I say, hi, my name is Regina. I'll be your nurse today. I will be giving you your medications, your wound dressings, I will be checking your IV site, and I also will be hanging your IV medications. Working with me today is Joanne. She is your nurse's aide. She can help you with taking you to the bathroom, if you need your meals heated up, if you would like juice or other snacks, Joanne is the person to call. We both are here with you from seven in the evening to seven in the morning. What this does is it establishes who you are and your responsibilities so that your patient knows if they need to get up and go to the bathroom, if they need some ice water, you are not the person that they contact. They contact Joanne because you have other things to do, such as documentation, medication, many other nursing responsibilities. Why don't you just do this at the beginning of your shift so that your night goes a lot more smoothly? Four, this is another thing. Before you bring a medication into a patient's room, do a quick sweep through to make sure that they have fresh water. So many times, and this happened to me too, as a new nurse, I would come in there with cups of medication and pills and everything, and then I would get to the patient's room and I would say, I have your medication here, and they say, oh, I need water, I want, I want fresh water with my medication. So I would have to take that medication with me out of the room to get water or to have somebody else go get water. Save yourself some time, check for water early. The fifth most common and most, I think, heinous mistake that new nurses make is not reading their employee handbook. During orientation, you're given so much paperwork, you're given policies of the hospital, but your employee handbook is super essential. And most of the time we just sign off, yeah, yeah, we got it, we read it, but we didn't really read it. In that employee handbook are your rights as a new nurse. It, it describes the policies for mandating you it describes the policies for your um, family medical leave, your sick days, the time frame that you need to give notification that you won't be into work. All of these things are super vital to um, your performance as a nurse and also your confidence in what you have the ability to do and what you don't have the ability to do. Read that employee handbook because in my opinion, Nurse managers take advantage of nurses who don't know what they have a right to and what they don't have a right to, okay? These are just my tips. I hope they help you guys. Thank you for watching my videos. Bye-bye.